We are a blockchain energy rewards platform, and we help the utilities uh, engage with their consumers. So basically, you were saying to me before that I could not use the grid and get paid. How does that work? How is that possible? Yeah, there's times during the year where it costs the utility a lot more money than they can receive back from you. And so they would gladly pay you to not use electricity during their peak hours. Okay, so, so during peak hours, I unplug my fan or my AC yeah. or whatever, and I get a bit hot, but I get paid. What, what do I get paid in? Well, you get a token, and you can take that to local participating merchants who will redeem it for a beer, an ice cream, a movie ticket, whatever it is that helps you. So I can cool down with a beer instead of a fan. That's right, basically. exactly. OK, so what kind of uh, companies are you uh, working with at this point? Yeah, so our first customer is Burlington, Vermont. And we're working with them to, to do just what we said, to help them save money on electricity. Uh, they're 100% renewable, and they have a plan to go to net zero. OK, and uh, so we sort of talked about other things that you guys might do in the future, which might include telling me when I should use power. C can you explain more about that, how, how that could work in the future? Yeah, absolutely. So as the cost for things like solar, batteries, and electric vehicles gets less and less expensive, managing the grid and managing supply and demand between all these new generators on the grid gets more and more complex. And so there are times when they would actually pay you to fill up your electric vehicle when there's too much solar power on the grid, for instance. OK, and you, so you guys are based on, on a blockchain, right? Correct. Have you done ICO? What's the, what, how's the company funded at this point? So far, we have an investment from a Fortune 500 utility in St. Louis and a fund from Alaska. OK, and are you planning to do an ICO or other kinds of funding at this Not point? Not at this time. We want to put more examples into the marketplace of, of what we can do. What you're doing right now is in, is in uh, the US. Do you have any plans to go overseas too? Absolutely. This isn't just something that's happening in the United States or Vermont or Illinois or Missouri or California. It's a global issue. And we are actively speaking with international utilities in Asia and Europe.